All right, how we doing, folks? So today's uh, uh, 30 January 2020. I got uh, like 9.30, a little bit past that here, uh, Pacific Standard Time here. And uh, again, I hope everybody's doing well and being safe out there and masking up, doing your social distancing and all that, all right, uh, to make things easier for everybody. All right, so I want to get right into it. So this is a topic about this second strand here, okay? And I'm going to have to do another part of this because I don't have the empirical data that I need. But uh, I did a video, I believe, uh, two days ago or so about a second uh, strand of this uh, mutant um, COVID uh, uh, virus that was found in the UK. And now, as of yesterday, this vaccine was found in Canada, okay? I forgot what part of Canada. I believe it was like in Eastern Canada, okay? Now, the information I do know is that uh, two people were tested with this uh, mutant virus uh, or diagnosed with this um, new strand here. And it was alleged by them that they didn't leave to go anywhere. Now, again, I don't want to give any misinformation, all right, but there could be a chance either they may have been exposed to some, uh, by somebody that, I don't know, a friend or family member that may have traveled to the UK or this thing may uh, mutate naturally, okay, to where it, where it, where it is now, okay? Uh, same thing that happened in Colorado uh, or similar, okay, as far as uh, that theory. Excuse me here. It's dry outside, so I want to put on some Carmex on my lips. Especially the corners there. All right? Uh, but, man, I just have, it's one of the things I want to do more research about this uh virus here oh, oh yeah because i've known that for a fact this uh virus does mutate okay that is mutated uh several and several times since march okay so is it kind of like a smart virus uh is it something that uh can uh survive or something that can um uh, adjust during like uh maybe certain climate situations or I don't know, like uh, based on what part of the world that you're in or let's just say if you, uh, I don't know, for instance, like take me medications or uh, I don't know, maybe the vaccine or whatever, is it going to smart um, mutate? Now I do know for a fact that over time, let's just take for instance, like uh, road spray, okay? And this will probably apply to some medicines too, that uh, cells and so forth do catch on to uh, any type of remedies or like serums and stuff like that and uh, medicines have to uh, from time to time have to be uh, revised and all that okay to kind of keep up with the Joneses as far as in uh, mutating um, cells or viruses and so forth all right but um, that's a, a good you know question there but it was found in Canada for the most part, all right? Um, and this virus, va uh, va I'm sorry, the mutated viruses in other countries out in the old world, out, uh, in the Eastern world, okay? Uh, they, it was alleged that they were in South Africa and then, I'm uh, not South Africa, but in Africa and some places out there in the far uh, East uh, that uh, it was alleged to be found. And I'm saying allegedly. Okay, but yeah, that's the article that I saw about this uh, new uh, strand here. So that'll be another challenge that uh, the society is going to have to deal with on top of the old strand. Okay, um, all I can just say is, ladies and gentlemen, just be very, very careful because this uh, mutated uh, vaccine has a something like a 30% chance. Uh, it's a it's a greater chance of it spreading. Okay, 
Um, and it's just as contagious as the uh, older uh, the older uh, virus. So yeah, this is something that is going to be uh, interesting to watch for the next I don't know three four months uh, until they can you know uh, medical staff can find a way to um, I don't know to get a handle or contain this this remedy. I mean I'm sorry the the, the virus. Okay. That's all I have on that. I need to do some research on the strand that was found in Colorado, and I'll come back with you guys on that, and there'll be other uh, topics to talk about, like the, uh, let's see here, um, stimulus checks, and also uh, like PUA and all that, uh, on uh, scenarios on that. Um, real quick, the stimulus checks are coming out uh, very, very soon here in the next few days. But it could take up to, from what I understand, eight months. Okay, but that's a different uh, topic for another time. Okay, but keep an eye out on this new strand, or uh, do your research. And um, again, there'll be more stuff to talk about. If you like this video, feel free to subscribe, leave your comments, likes, and shares. Okay, and uh, this video is for the ears that want to hear. All right, peace.